to you by the students of the enrichment area. Hi, welcome back to this week's episode of DCE Live, brought to you by E4D. My name is Jared and this is Georgia. On the couch we have Eleanor and Luke and behind the scenes we have Sarah, Justin, Jesse, Dylan and Pacey on the teleprompter. Now over to Luke on the couch for the sports report. I hope you have something to say about volleyball girls. Thanks Georgia. Last Friday for sport the girls volleyball team played district against Sacred Heart. The girls won two sets nil. Great job to everyone and good luck at regionals. For sport this week, we're playing Plenty Valley away. We have started summer sports again. Again, The sports are cricket, volleyball, rounders, basketball and bat tennis. Make sure you bring your $7 for the bus. Next Wednesday, 45 Challenge students are going to Lorimer Primary School for Kanga Cricket. They'll be playing lots of schools from around the district. I'm sure everyone will do their best and have a great time. When I did it, I sure had fun. Back to the desk. Wow, Georgia. Congratulations. Who do you think was your best player for your team? I think it was Hannah because she was showing some very good skills, but everyone did really well. Auslan is something else we do very well at DC. I wonder what the sign of the week is. Today's signs are boys and girls. I'm a boy. And I'm a girl. Now we have an important reminder about the DCE Fabathon. The Fabathon is a coming up soon, so be sure to hand in your pamphlet and money back as soon as possible. Remember that there are great prizes to be won, as well as raising money for our school. So let's have a look at the ad. Good afternoon, everyone. Mr. Rostol is here with some special news about a fundraiser that we're going to conduct in term four. It will be a fabathon and it'll be held in November. And we're hoping that everyone joins in and raises some valuable funds for our school. In a moment, there'll be a short DVD that'll explain to you how the fundraiser works. We're going to call it a fabathon. And as a fabathon, we're going to do lots of fantastic activities that make you feel good. With, it, with this particular fundraiser, you can also um, earn points for yourself and win some special prizes as well as contributing to um, our fundraising activities at Diamond Creek East. Thank you. Remember last week we heard some s fantastic sporting achievements that happened over the holidays? Now we have another slideshow of another great team effort.
I'm here with Mrs Murray. Mrs Murray, what sports did you do on the day? Well, we were in the Novice Lawn Bowls event. That's nice. <laughs> did you win any of the sports? Um, we played um, several matches and we only lost one. That's good. Yeah. Who was in your team? Well, there was Mrs Wilson, Mrs Latham, Miss Pierce and myself. Have you ever played lawn bowls before? We've been to the teacher games a few times and we always play lawn bowls when we go to the teacher games. But I learned how to play lawn bowls with the grade fives. <laughs> Will you bring the team back for next year? Oh, we're hoping for a, a return. Yes, absolutely. Thank you and well done on your achievement. Thank back you. To the desk. Congratulations to Mrs Murray, Miss Pierce, Mrs Latham and Mrs Wilson. We certainly have some talented teachers at DCA. Speaking of talent, DCA once again showed what a great school we are at the town fair. Now over to Eleanor for a report. On the 21st of September, it was the town fair. 250 students came to the town fair and dressed as heroes and superheroes. The Discovery students dressed as variety of superheroes, the challenge and enrichment students represented our real life heroes, including firefighters, armed services, police, RSPCA, lifesavers, Red Cross and other medical services. We were awarded first place in the primary school section. Now we have a video of the town fair. Congratulations DCE on another great effort. Remember we should all be wearing our hats outside this term. This Friday night the D1 students will be having their dinner at school. They will be playing games and having a sausage sizzle before going home. I remember doing that. It was lots of fun. A reminder to parents that the PrEP 2014 information evening is next Wednesday the 23rd. Thank you for watching this week's episode of DCE Live. Tune in next week for the next episode. Bye. Bye.